That's not bad. I haven't looked yet because I hit the record button. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. What Cold Guns Command? Yeah, I was way more. I thought it was gonna be something way more exciting. No. When this deals combat damage to a creature, put a one negative one negative one counter. When it, you put one or more negative one counter life. Okay. Oh wait. So whenever it deals damage to a creature, they get one counter. And then it, it drains for one. I like preordained. I, I mean, Cold Guns Command is probably pretty good actually. I have to assume it's this, but it does put us into two colors, which is kind of. I mean, weird. up until now, you've drafted at least three. <laughs> That's well, no, the black white deck was two. I did that one though. What was one before that? Abzan? Yeah, something like that. And then yesterday it was the five color deck. Yesterday it was Soul Tie and five color. Okay. I, I see what you're saying here. I'm taking it as kind of a slight, but that's I mean preordained could be good too. I think it's no Colgon. I think Colgon's man the upside is just way too high. Gets a dude back, kills an artifact, kills a thing. Yeah, I'm taking it. What if you what if you answered the the telemarketer call as a robot, and you were like, "Hello." What if you answered it as a Japanese robot? Can you do a Japanese robot? Moshi moshi. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Combo attack is fantastic. Two target creatures deal damage equal to their power to target creature. That pretty much would kill anything. But I think we're just taking arena because yeah, that sounds good. It's black. I hope Alchemist Green comes back. That card is what's known as a banger. I want a tiny mouse pad. I don't like using mouse pads because I like being able to see my desk. But I don't want to ruin it either, so. I need a tiny mouse pad. But like a quality one with like, you know the, you know how they have the ones with the like. Made out of spider silk? Yeah, the spider silk ones. Yeah. Right, when you milk the buttholes. Yep. Yeah, those are the ones I like. You know, you know, you know exactly. You were like. I'm down. I know the ones he's talking about. He's talking about those butthole milking. Wheel of Fate? That's something, all right. Well, we have to look for a third color card, so probably Pima Outrider, maybe? We don't have to look for a third color. That was the joke. God, you take That's the joke. That's the joke. The goggles, they do nothing. Spider-Man can poop you a new mouse pad. Well, if you can find them, let me know. I'm going to take this thing. This is a fine... You know what? You don't want to do Wheel of Fate? I don't. I don't want to give my opponents cards. I don't want to suspend it and have to wait four turns for it to work. I don't want my opponent to be like, all right, cool, I played all the cards in my hand because I knew this was happening. Putrefy. <laughs> all rats have fear. It's mm -hmm. two, three, four, five. Sack a rat. Create X, one, one black rats where X is the number of rats you control. So one rat turns into two rats. No, I guess you'd have two rats. So if you have this and one other rat, you sack the other rat... Yeah, you make two rats, right? And then you sack one of those rats, and then you make three rats. Hmm. No, because it's part of the cost, right? Yeah, we, you would need more than two rats, I think. Like, Do if, you ever net rats with this? Yeah, if you had three rats, you would net rats. Oh, because for every one you're getting rid of, you're making... Yeah, it doesn't seem great, though, right? How many rats are we going to have? Probably just that one. That's the only one, right? I'm still going to take it, because it's, uh, it's rat upside. And now I am incentivized to take other rats. Negative one, it deals two damage to that creature. No, that's... I think it's actually Hunter of Eye Blights. You wanted to take this last time. It doesn't look bad. <laughs> eh, meh. Oh, Draco again. What? This is way too many, right? Like... We could take Steam Steamflogger, boss. Oh, Does that make a contraption? God. No. If you would assemble one, though, oh, it okay. assembles two instead. Sack a rat, make more rats. Sack a contraption, make more contraptions. Bogger Brute's very good as 3-2 menace for... Yeah, I'm just taking this. Wait, Iron Mirror. Actually, that's not bad. Yeah, Iron Mirror seems good. I'm a fan of what you just did. Grape Shot. Grape Shot. No. What? This is just removal. But it's Grape Shot. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> you see how I still took that? Gutter Snipe. Dude, take Gutter Snipe. There's a Seal of Doom. Why are you having me take these terrible cards? Actually, we're also not that red yet. It's true. Look at this thing. Look at this fucking... You don't, you don't want to play Leveler? <laughs> I mean, I didn't say I didn't want to. <laughs> <laughs> and you could play it with Phyrexian Soul Gorger? I wouldn't say I didn't want to, Bob.
This is actually not terrible, right? You just pump a dude for a million and then, like, draw a card? Yeah. I was expecting this to be, like, sacrifice that creature at the end of the turn or something. Uh, let's get some one on counter, remove it to switch it. Oh, all creatures get neg one, neg one. Mm. I'm going to take the Glee. Ooh, take the Changeling. When this time is Battlefield, any player must sacrifice two creatures. What? But why? For the rats. I like that you pointed to it as if I wouldn't know what it was. Take it for the rats. All right, I actually will take it for the rats. Do it for the rats. Now all of my Facebook ads are for watches because I've been looking at watches recently. Wait, what is that? That's a altered mox. Oh, okay. Done in the in the style of the Great Wave. Why would you do that? Well, because it's a lot of times they're done to uh, cards that are pretty beat up. Oh. So like you're you're just covering the damage and making it just a more presentable card. Wheel of Fate came back. <sighs> yeah, it sure did. I'm just gonna take this. Could be good. It seems good. Oh, ingot chewer. What about what is it? Blade brand. What is this? Yeah, I guess it could be blade brand. All right, I'll take a blade brand. Mega morph. And this guy's what a four six. It becomes a five seven if you flip it. Mm -hmm. I think that's fine. I don't think we're playing any enough creatures to really play Grusalka. Seed Flogger boss came black. Came black? Yep. <laughs> oh, the rigors you control. I'm going to take this Dread Return. Look at this basically mono black. All we have is one Kologon's command, so talk about being limited colors. You got a green card now. Yeah. Oh, wow. We can take Greater Gargadon. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> Epicure I mean, of Blood? If I was going to take a red card, I'd probably take Unlicensed Disintegration. Do take Epicure of Blood. But I'm real tempted to take Fell our Guardian. Sovereign. I keep calling it Guardian. I'm not taking Epicure of Blood. If there's one card that is life-based <laughs> in this pack, I'm definitely taking Felidar. And then this probably comes back. Probably. And this is a 4-6 Vigilance Lifelinker that has an alternate wind condition attached. Take Coalition Honor Guard. Oh, Ghostly Changeling is a rigger. It's true. That's funny. Guys, is it Sovereign or is it Unlicensed Disintegration? Vote now. I mean, what's the chance of us getting 40 life? I mean, it, it doesn't have to be 40 life. It's still a 4 6 Vigilance Lifelinker, which is pretty good. Disintegration seems fine, though. I will donate 10 for Reach Win with the alternate win. It's never going to happen. Uh, whenever this or another non permanent you control is put into a graveyard, each opponent sacrifices a permanent that shows a card type with it. That's interesting. It's kind of like... Shatter. Oh, Meteorite. Yeah, Meteorite's kind of trash, though. Did you just get excited? Why did you get excited about this? Because it deals two damage. <laughs> Ooh! I think I do like Mind Shatter, though. Yeah. Or... Yeah, that seems good, too. Dark Withering is nice, too. Do we have any discard outlets yet? I don't think so. But I also don't think it matters. Like, it's just a, it's just an instant destroyed non-black creature. Uh, Mind Shatter's a, a discard outlet. That's true. We just target ourselves and then we discard this. Think of the savings. Oh, God. Which one is it, guys? Well, now I'm putting Kolagon's Command back in. Take Mind Shatter. Oh, I guess we took this, even though I was literally grabbing Kolagon's Command. Wait, what did we back. take? We took the Dark Withering. <laughs> so, thankful. <laughs> Dude, are you serious? <laughs> There's no way we've seen three one with nothings in out money. of four drafts. That's uh, pretty ridiculous. And you said this would never happen. Showed you. <laughs> Wait, what never happened? Well, he said I'll give you ten dollars for every for every uh, alternate win win you get. Oh, okay. And I said that'll never happen. I was referring to the alternate win. Yeah, yeah. He thought I was referring to the donation. Oh, I see. And here we are. Rage reflection. What about tidy conclusion? Destroy a creature. That's pretty good too. Another instant, too. So, do <laughs> you want to just give all our dudes double strike? <laughs> I, like, again, wait, I don't... Wait, 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 Beacon of Immortality? We, we didn't take the guard. Oh, weak. The Sovereign. So, like, again, how, out of a 1,600 card set, have we seen this card three times in five drafts? That seems extremely implausible. 
That's it's just it's weird. Ooh, Ashnod's altar. You can do some broken stuff. How with many that. three drops and five drops are in this format? Did you take Ashnod's altar and we get a way to create uh, tokens? I'm trying to take this guilt leaf palace in case we want to splash something. Because I'm, you know, I just I don't want to be. Sometimes I just don't want to be restricted to only two cards. What is this? Just a four four? What set is that? I don't know. I've never even seen this thing. Maybe it's one of those weird, like, like. Uh, well, here's the thing. It's called Ferocious Zeng. Uh, the artist is Asian. GS one. So I'm pretty sure this is from. Well, it's only out of a 40 card set. That's probably I'm from pretty like, sure a, those it's like a specific Asian. Something. Yeah, it's just a, probably an Asian set. Manamorphos. I mean, that's what I'm actually leaning towards. Because there's like nothing else here, and it's just a literal can trip, and it fixes. Maybe we'll get Thousand Year Storm. Bro, what is this? Ooh, take it. I mean, I wish it was like a burglar rat. What is the. Okay, again, I don't understand the frequency that we're seeing the same cards. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. Uh, 5 4 4 4. When it enters the battlefield, discard a card at random. If you discard a creature this way, it deals damage equal to that card's power to target player plans order. So there's literally just 5 4 4 4 that's like two for ones you. Maybe. Unless it's the last card in your hand. Yeah. Cathartic Reunion and Thrill in the same pack? That's kind of weird. I kind of like Thrill. Are they the same card? Oh, no. You just this one. is discard two to draw three. This is discard one to draw two. Maybe the rats will wheel. I mean, also just not impressed with that as a 1-1 as a one, one for two just for Maronar. Yeah. Look. Two black cards that are five drops. Balduvian Horde, another... Another four mana five five that uh, makes you discard a card. Yep. All right. You could take that goblin burrows. I could. I really could. <sighs> the retail version of mystery boosters replaced the playtest cards with subject full. Oh, hold on. Uh, pay two life. I mean, they're both four threes. This probably seems better to give it flying. Shrouded Lore. Gain haste, draw a card. Plus two, plus two for two. And they all get all creature types. Actually, this is a pretty sweet trick with like Marinar because then they get uh, fear. You can make an extra rat. Was there another card we had that cared about uh, creature types? Oh, we were, you were thinking of the rigor. We I didn't was. take it. Replace the playtest cards with specific foil cards like one with nothing. So it was only available as a foil within mist. Why? Everybody's been chomping for that uh, foil one with nothing. <laughs> hey, man, look, your Epic Hero of Blood came back. Sweet. Uh... Sure. Vampire sub theme. Oh, hey, Rage. Look, there it is again. Dope. Rage Reflection came Take back. It. I'm, it's not, we're not playing that thing. This card's actually great. Cool. Oh, are you just are you mad now? <laughs> cool yeah. card, bro. Cool card, man. Thanks for taking thanks for not taking the guy. Oh, Mephetic Vapors came back. Now we have two cards that give all creatures cower and fear, negative one, negative one. Oh man, we could we could do negative two. For us only for yeah, for only six mana. Bam. Enchanted evening. Ooh, ravenous trap. Why do you get excited about Ravenous Trap every time? It's Ravenous. I guess that's true. Instill Infection. Kiln Fiend. This guy's actually... This guy is fine. Yep. But, I mean, and again, it's another 3 drop, and we already have 7 3 drops. True. So I'd almost rather take, like, a 2 drop so that we don't get... 
points for each other creature control. It's not bad. You got a lot of creatures. You got five seconds. Oh god, you're right. Oh, well, I guess that's... Ooh, Contagion Clasp. Yeah, I actually like Contagion Clasp. What if Chandra's Revolution deals four to a creature, tap target land, that land doesn't untap? Yeah, that's actually really good. Seems good. Yeah, that seems great. Chandra's Revolution. Ooh, Duretti. Duretti. Too bad we don't have any artifacts to use with it. I think Gruul Signet's probably just fine. Yeah. Goes well with our Iron Mirror and our Manamorphos. What does Duretti do? Oh, it's just looting. Or rummaging, apparently. Well, well corrected. Yeah, I'm going to take Gruul Signet. Yeah. Conspiracy. Creatures you control are the chosen type. Name Rat. There's Tectonic Edge. Uh, look, I mean, again, it's like five drop, five drop, four drop, that's disguised as a three drop. I think it's actually fine. Yeah. I also kind of like Zertodger, but we're never going to be able to cast it. And also, Avarax kind of sucks because you don't have other Avaraxes. So, what if another Avarax came around? Well, I'd feel real stupid. But then the other, then I'd take that one, and hopefully the other Avarax comes back. Look at this Allosaurus Rider. You know what, Living Death? Gurmag Angler. We have a oh that's right you you just unequip it and equip it to a different creature yeah it's just super expensive. Living death is interesting, but oh what up Arctic Avenger my dude um it might just be Gurmag Angler yeah that seems fine it's yeah like, Arctic Avenger oh I like Carn Wander ooh I mean I don't know how many creatures we're gonna have in the graveyard and again it's a five drop this guy's unexciting this guy's also a five drop this is also a five drop I don't understand how much there's so many five drops we do have a little bit of ramp though I mean how many creatures do you have with even these abilities not much right is it just your graveyard or any graveyard a graveyard alright that's actually I'm definitely taking this now wow that's insane yeah so I guess Karthus is one of the cards they also like Deliberately inserted. Blightning would be good too. Because we also have Manamorphos, Gruel Signet, and uh, wasn't there another card we had? Guilt Leaf Palace, which yeah. is kind of nice. Maybe the maybe the Blightning will wheel. This is also a problem. Yeah, that would be sweet if the Blightning wheeled. I have my doubts, but actually, six, seven, eight. I think it'd be the last card in the pack. Unfortunately, Goblin Matron. Search for a Goblin. You uh, search for Changelings. If you control two or more swamps, put a negative one, negative one counter on a creature. You could use Goblin Matron to circ up uh, your Cane Wanderer. You mean Karen Wander? Sure, whatever. This guy's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, nothing else happening in there. Maybe snapping sail back. They're ready. Do we have enough artifacts? I don't know if we... Like, we don't really need it. You just... You, it's just a looter. That's true. So we don't have, like, an artifact payoff. Like, some huge... This is a lot of cards. Maybe a giant artifact will, here. will wheel. Curd ape. I think you're upkeep sacrifice unless you pay two black. I think you're end step credit. This is just an engine. That's fine. Two blacks a lot. Hmm. What? what? 
Wow, that's amazing. How Holy is that possible? Because no one else is in black red, really. So Still, it's just, though. I know. <laughs> wow, that's sick. Wow, that was bananas. Mm. Dirty's also good because you have several uh, mana oh, creatures starts, like yeah, this and like the Dark Withering. We could also like discard something like Karthus or like, I don't think Maranar is very good here. Which means, actually, this guy's probably just fine as a 2-2 two, two for 3 that pumps. Mm. I'm going to take Blade Brand. Man, we're really waiting here. Seven more cuts. Butcher's Glee is kind of meh. We have a lot of removal. Seal. Do we take Living Death? No. Mm. Seal, Disintegration. Dust Stranger, Weird Vampire. What a weird, what a weirded vampire. It's been weirded. Take Epicure Blood out. How do you weird something? <laughs> Buddy, you got me. This is also Destroy a Creature with a Counter on it, so then it kind of makes Instill Infection a little better. Dope. Thrill is kind of whatever. I agree with that. We also have Duretti as a... What is, what is Duretti's ultimate? Uh, get an emblem with whenever an artifact is put into a graveyard. Return that card to the battlefield at the beginning of the next end step. So we, we get like infinite... Or Executioner's Capsules? Yeah. So someone, you know, in, someone in the chat just If he gets activated like too. six times. Um, also, discarding with Duretti is great for Gurmag Angler, which we want to uh, to delve I also don't give a shit about kill. Actually, it should be fine. How many spells do we have? 13? A good amount. Did you just make 13 up? No. You were looking at creatures? Yeah, I was looking at creatures. Unbelievable. It's in center sorcery, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, Metamorphos. Dark Withering. Conclusion. Revolution. Oh. Dread Return actually seems fine. It's like nine spells. It's not bad. Discard Karthus. Dread yeah, that's all right, exactly. And I also don't want to cut more creatures because I have 13, so... But, like, I don't want to cut four removal spells either. <laughs> so it's kind of awkward. So, uh, the Arctic Avenger, we're going to eat some super spicy uh, death chips tomorrow. So you can watch that. Me and Mike B. Burning our faces off. Death chips, check it and see... I'm going to eat these hot chips with my B. I'm just going to keep refreshing. Um, so, Jimmy the Mole, it was it was mostly fine. Like, the airport wasn't too busy, but that could have just been because it was a Thursday. Um, and then I didn't have anybody sitting next to me or anything. And I just got, like, on the plane last, so I wasn't really, like, walking by anybody. Delta was also loading the plane from the back to the front. Um, so that That's a good idea. So you're not passing people. Right. That's actually a great idea. And I also don't know why they just don't do that normally. Yeah, well, the reason they don't do it normally is because they want to give their uh, people with status uh, bonuses. Whatever, man. The $100 Carolina chips. We got those um, uh, one chip challenge. It's like Carolina Reaper. I don't know what four cards to cut. This is actually surprisingly difficult. Kiln Fiend? I mean, you can then you don't need as much red up front. This problem is like we just it's one of the few things we have to do on turn two. Well, I mean that's assuming you get some red mana. Sure. I guess. <laughs> How much removal do we... I guess... I think Instill Infection is probably one of the weaker cards in here. Yeah. Which means Kiln Fiend is also probably one of the weaker cards. What is the filigree familiar? It's actually just a 2-2. It gains 2 life, but when it dies, you draw 2. Or you draw a card. I mean, a card. I think it's actually just fine. It's well-rounded. Two more cuts, or one cut. And we can just play 41. We have 12 creatures. I don't really want to go down to 11 here. They also give you nice little wipes to wipe down your seat with. And then uh, they still hand out food, but it's all like pre-packaged into like a bag. Yeah. So also, you had a short flight, so I imagine you weren't getting like... Yeah. So they just hand you a bag with some like water and one of those granola bar things.
So, Shoe Gardener, I've actually done the one-chip challenge before. It's very painful, and it burns for like an hour. Does Michael B. know this? I don't think so. Milk does not help. So, the milk, like, makes it feel cool while it's in your mouth, but the second you swallow it, it does nothing. <laughs> the milk, it does nothing. The milk does nothing. I mean, we can cut to Red Return. It's probably too cute. Is it just your graveyard? Yeah. Okay. If it was each graveyard or any graveyard, I'd be like, oh, that's cool. Yeah, one here, ten, four. The goggles, they do nothing. So this is nine, six, and two. That seems fine. Mm. We don't have any double red. Eight, 14, 15, 16. Oh, we got one more. It's probably seven. We have like a bunch of... Yeah, that's fine. All right, cool. Hot-blooded, check it and see. This deck was hard to make, cuts from for me. Wait, what is the... Oh, because the grapefruit soda is like super carbonated oh. or something? Okay. Grape soda, it burns your mouth. Grape soda, it'll burn your throat. Oh, do they go to six cards too? Blink 180 Jew is our opponent's name. Wow. That's fantastic. Wow. Oh, boy. <laughs> Good times. Are grapes a citrus? N no. Grapefruits are. I think we're just playing arena, right? The one card is better than the three damage. I wonder if, like, grape and grapefruit is super confusing oh, to, like, people who don't speak English. Card. Nice. Uh, I think it's confusing to me, and I speak English, so I would say yeah. Oh, yeah. Turn three arena in normal limited format seems pretty insane. Oh, get Mutual drunk first. Yeah, that's good. And then he'll vomit all over my desk and computer. Ooh, yeah, we should get Sunny D as a chaser. To the one chip challenge. I mean, you can counter this guy. It's totally fine. If you're gonna if you're gonna one for one us when we have arena out, like that is not gonna end up in your favor, my dude. And we can just use that to cast Gourmet Angler. Right, you're just helping me out. You're just helping old zombie fish. You got it. Again, it's a one for one, so... Are they going to take the Angler? I, they have to, because otherwise you just play it next turn. And that's better than the other two creatures, so... Maybe they don't realize you can play it next turn. Oh, maybe they're like, Well, you have seven mana, so I guess I'll just take it. Wow, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> just going to take the Minotaur. I love a good Minotaur. Nope, he took the Angler. Damn it. The Angler for my Dangler. Now he's surveilling. And they stuck in a Graft Mage into the trash can. We're slowly dying, Frank. You're right. But it gives us a chance to live. So you're saying there's a chance? Yes. Are they gonna... You think they're gonna mana like this guy? No? Okay. Hot blooded. Why do I have hot blood stuck in my head? How do these songs get in my brain? You should do like a karaoke challenge with Mike B and see if you can sing a song well enough that it gets demonetized. I don't think I could. But I appreciate that you think I could. Oh, propaganda. Wait, what does that do? Uh, we have to pay two mana for each creature that attacks. Oh. Which should be fine. Cool. When you have Frexian Arena, like... Man has no object. Do we have any way to destroy enchantments? No, we're black red. Do you have to pay two for each creature? Yes. Oh, weak. That's fine. Buddy, I ain't sweating it. Hot blood, do you have the Rona? I don't. At least I don't think so, unless Kerwa brought it with him from Seattle. We're all gonna die. But I feel like that's small likelihood. We can only hope. <laughs> that's true. I do, in fact, hope that. Oh, look at those river wheel aerialists. 
More like trash list. Oh, what? Oh, say what? Oh, they have two cards? <laughs> Not anymore. Huh. Well, isn't that something? Um, you don't have enough to cast Karthus, right? I don't. I do, but I can't attack with him because of the propaganda. So it's uh, not super right. Wow, this is brutal. We have Frexian Arena, and we're putting them down to no cards in hand. That's a big old yikes. Fledging Malkor is nice. The both of those cards are great. Not anymore. Now they're trash. Is this an artifact because it's a shapeshifter? That would be cool. Yeah. If it was also a land, it was every land type. <laughs> artifact enchantment swap for... Oh, that's a good top deck. Especially when we have Karthus. But I'm pretty sure you're just going to block one of these dudes. And we're going to have nine mana when we play this, so... Doretti Spaghetti. Hey, you can sacrifice that filigree familiar for a different artifact. And draw a card. That's true, but I don't have another artifact, unfortunately. In the deck? It's in the graveyard. It's not oh, a, it has to be in the graveyard? Search. Yeah, it's not a search. Uh, weak. Weak. Maybe you'll get Executioner's Capsule. That would be sweet. I would enjoy that very much. I bet you would. So if we hit a land next turn, we can go Karthus and attack with Karthus, and that's pretty good, because seven sevens are generally pretty big. They get the job done. Oh boy. Oh boy. Too bad they don't have any creatures to kill, because we don't kill them all. That's true. I just paid a green. Why are you, why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? This guy's a tyrant of Jund. Think they just scoop? Yeah. Oh, they killed the shapeshifter, so we he, we don't get the other dragon creature thing. <laughs> well, yes, but we already. You know what? Synergy, Frank. Synergy. It's true. It's all about that value. It's true. What is this? Foot Locker? Look PSG clean in these new kicks. You, no. know, you don't want the PSG kicks? Not a fan of the Paris Saint Germain? Oh, look Germain. at this. They're just going to... Well, they didn't even chump. Well, I don't know, man. That's not going to do it. That seems like a mistake. That's a mistake. What are you going to do? Trepanation Blade. Whenever it attacks, time play rose cards until they land. That creature gets plus one, plus one. Are they just going to try to hit like... They're just going to try to get lucky and make it like... Alright, you only got to hit 13 lands in a row. <laughs> Wait, is it not a land or until you hit a land? Uh, it's until you hit a land. Okay. We mill cards until we hit a land. So, three cards and one land. So we take seven and they're like, okay, concede. Yep. No blocks. All in all, not a bad two cards and... Uh... <coughs> oh god, he does have the Rona. It's the Rona setting in. Maybe he's got that one blue mana fog card. He don't. I think he was just holding it for the next game. Didn't want to tip his hand. He had it, though. <sighs> I yeah, think I'm using the Dr. Pepper to hold down the Rona. I think if you keep drinking it, then you can eventually keep it down forever. It's true. Pandemonious literally beat this exact dude last round with his own Nem of Reason. Hey, Thanos, what up? Oh, Thanos, what up, my dude? I'll keep this hand. We do need another what's known as a black source. 
Thomas, you're gonna have both a weed cough and a Rona cough in the same cough. Hopefully, I mean, you don't smoke and you don't hopefully have the Rona. So, where's this cough really coming from, buddy? Cancer. <laughs> That's got dark real fast. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Dude, lightning in the opening ham seems good. Too bad it's not random. Like if it was a lightning bolt combined with a ham. He says stuff like this, and the only thing I can think is, wow, I'm really glad you don't design cards. <laughs> what if you could target, too? What if it was discard two cards at random and then three deal, deal three damage to any target? Any number of targets. And then your opponent sacrifices two creatures. <laughs> and then they lose the game. Okay, well, we both have our, our three-man enchantments on deck. I think mine's better. Probably. If they go land thing, they discard two cards, and they go to one card, and we have a ring out. It's just that, like, this card, this amount of card advantage is just pretty insurmountable. Okay, then well, that guy's good. But, oh, this just kills it, right? Mm. No, you put a 1-1 one, one counter on a creature you don't control. But then it does kill it after but that. But then you can kill it. That also kills it. So does that. Oh, it's a non-black. But this also, we can kill this and keep their swamp tap down. True. Oh, also, with Karn Wander, this gets flying in Death Touch. Ooh. That's actually pretty Does solid. it also draw you a card? <laughs> Unfortunately. What if it, like, gained it all not. text blocks from all cards in graveyards? That would be pretty insane, actually. And I think that would actually be incredibly broken. Oh, they got that trepanation blade again. Good thing they don't have any creatures. They have three cards. Do we play Karn Wander, or do we just make them discard two of their three cards? I mean, making them discard seems good. This puts a body on the board, and then we can attack and Blightning next turn. True. Yeah, I'm just going to put some... Put some fat pressure on the board. Flying death touch, 4-4. Four, four. You done screwed up, AA, Ron. I really hope that guy's actually Jewish. I don't, I don't know what this is, so... Someone's requesting to trade. If someone is watching, I'm just going to accept it, and I'll put it over here, and we'll see what happens. And we're going to go back to our match now. They didn't do anything. Imagine you were, like, running out of time, or they were running out of time, and you, like, right as their, like, turn popped up, you, like, popped up a trade thing in front of them, and then they ran out of time. Someone says sup, and then that, so I guess they know who I am. I guess this was a deliberate. If you're in the chat, let me know. Man, Frexian Arena Blightning Carnwander seems good here. Okay, they discarded name Nemesis of. Wait, what just happened? What? Okay, that's weird. Bye-bye now. All right, that was weird. And I don't know what's going on. That's true. We could have blightened ourselves and then madness the vampire out. I actually feel kind of dumb now for not doing that. Are they going to play 3-3 flyer and then... Uh, Trepanation Blade us? That seems kind of wild. Super Fritz is Chat Spartacus. Is that true? That's what he said. I don't even know what that means. Do you know who Spartacus is? What's happening right now? Spartacus Mike. <laughs> All 
All right, let's see how many they mill. Wait, what did I do that One was diabolical? Card. Sounds good. All right. Well, you got it. But I don't even know what's going on over there. I'm trying to focus on this Magic the Gathering game. Okay, I believe you. I'll jump in the line. Run your money in time. Okay. Okay, so we definitely can go capsule and unlicensed. Oh, hold on, watch this. Look at this meta play. Capsule. Unlicensed on this guy. Take your damage. Shoot this guy. Shut up and take my money. Seems good. Oh, Spartacus, thank you for the dollar, Spartacus. It's like we dealt damage without having to attack. Boom. It's truly outrageous. The real Spartacus is the friends we made on the way. <laughs> See, that's funny. That was me. That was... Did you make that up yourself? Pandemonious. I'm gonna play Siggy. Siggy Piggy. Has he gotten any other abilities yet? No. He's still just a death touch flyer. Dude, imagine you had taken that banding creature. That was a different draft. And it ended up in the graveyard. God, all you can think about is banding. And then he had banding. You're obsessed. I wonder if he would get bands with legends. Thank you. I was in a band with some legends once. Yeah? No. T. Ravis, thank you so much for the reason. Did, what didn't relax and Sam be like, "Hey, can you answer this question before you go?" And, or and and then he never asked the question. Yeah, I, I seem to remember that. I was like, "Well, what's going on? Tell me the question." We have four cards. They have one. We have a Phyrexian. Or, okay, they just this is just literally draw one every time. I mean, typically you're gonna draw two, but they did not so. Oh, Colagon's command. Coca Cola Gon's command. I think we just killed him, right? Is that right? Seems like a good play. That's my that's my strategy. Uh target player discards a card. Target player uh return a creature. One, two, three. Arctic seems sweet. So much so that we just crushed this match, so that's cool. They have conceded. You were? We played crafts for long... What does that mean? Oh, wait. What did I say? Fuck. We did. We did play crafts for a long time. Did you win? Any deck that plays turn through arena every game is going to be good. Well, not if your opponent plays, like, burn. And it's time. Did you ask if I won? Were you not here? No, I asked if you won playing craps. Actually, yeah. I think we came out ahead. Sweet. Turn one. Executioner capsule. Is playing craps a euphemism? It can be. I'll never tell. Shut up and take my money. Okay. Oh, Ben Hur donated a dollar. <laughs> Man, that's so nice of these old timey, uh, these old timey gladiator Greek and Roman moves to, to to donate to the stream. It's very nice of them. We're gonna save this Manamorphos, and then Carthus is gonna actually draw us a card when it comes into play. Can you imagine? Oh, they played two swamps, and we have an Executioner's Capsule. It's kind of awkward. Everything okay? Yeah, I was just talking to my contractor. Oh, are they asking like about details? Yeah. 
Kurt literally has people working on his home right now. Yep. And I told him, I would be like, I thought that was kind of weird. I would be like, hey, can you... Uh, I don't know. I feel weird about people just being in my house while I'm not there. Because I know we both have pricey collectibles and things. So Possessions are fleeting, Frank. Yeah, people steal them for sure. I, and also, I know you don't believe that because you collect them as well so like you appreciate the the uh like the ownership and the collecting of of material things so but someday they will be gone well yeah but so will you right true true boy this executioner's capsule is looking uh pretty sus sus as they say maybe you can make one of their creatures not black you know, and I'm not sure. Get a painter's favorite or something? I do not. This is the perfect talk to celebrate my death day. So, Shoe Gardener, they're probably not doing much work. They're just chopping holes in the walls as far as I know right now. Hacking and whacking and chopping those holes. Yep. All the pictures I've seen are just of holes in walls. That didn't have holes before. I was trading here. Seems good. And I could block here, but they clearly have like a trick. Sure. Hey, if that... If that horse dies... Will our... Uh, Cairn Wanderer get a scent? What kind of scent? Do you think he's scent. Gonna, what's he going to smell like? I don't know. When this attacks, it gets plus two, plus oh. Well, that's something in it. This guy have lifelink? I'm like, why am I still at... Uh, Thanos, no. I didn't drive. I flew. So we're going to take... F one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. If we don't block, and we can still easily block this. All right. We're going to try to risk it for the biscuit. I'm making this guy big. Hey, we can executioner's capsule something now. Well, one thing anyway. Next turn we do get to kill both of these if we survive. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We go to eight. Risk biscuits don't taste good. You could risk it for the biz quick. Get some pancakes. I don't think it's a risk though. I just go buy it from the store, you know? True. I mean, you're talking about modern conveniences here, buddy. Mm. One of those automatic pancake machines. Okay, when you cycle this, you have target creature in fear. Sure. Maybe he'll give your creature fear. <laughs> you know, maybe. Maybe. I don't Does he know that that doesn't really do anything? Yeah, that's why they're that's why it's 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 his main phase. They did nothing. Four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, okay. So this is what, three, and this is two, so one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I think we're just going to pass here and uh, kill all the things and... Uh, Let them get wrecked. What's the weirdest automated machine you saw in Japan? That's a good question. The weirdest automated machine. Let me think. So they have a bunch of vending machines that like cook food for you. Um, there's restaurants that you can go to where it like delivers your food on like a conveyor belt. Like, not like a sushi conveyor belt where, the, like, all the food just goes around. You go on the machine and, like, click what you want in and this thing, like, slides out with your food. Um, let me think about... So, they also, like, if you go to a 7-Eleven, they'll have a machine that'll pretty much sell you tickets to anything. You can, like, go in there and buy airplane tickets or, like, uh, con like I bought t concert tickets to see uh, Paul McCartney from a 7-Eleven. That's interesting. I'm trying to think if there was other like weird automated machines. 
Look at that city's blessing. Good for you, buddy. Making sure I didn't make a weird mistake like this guy has indestructible once he has the city's blessing. <laughs> Boom! Kill them all. Also, this guy gets a counter on it when he deals damage. So, I guess I'll just take it? Oh, I know what the weirdest machine I saw in Japan was. At the bowling alley, there was a machine for dispensing your bowling shoes. Maybe your bowling shoes. Yes, my bowling shoes. Exactly. Wow. They, uh, they're going for it out there. They really were, man. That was wild. Oh, yeah. Are they using it against you? Oh, no. They can't do that. Mike B ones. is racing outside. Yeah, I don't care about that thing. Oh, yeah. There's, like, those dudes that play the rhythm games, like, super fast. And it's ridiculous. The rhythm games? Mm-hmm. There's like a couple rhythm games they don't have in the U.S. either. Like there's this one where it's like this round thing that goes around the outside of like a circular screen. And the stuff like comes out and there's just buttons around the outside. What are you fucking doing with your hands? This is wild, man. Let's add a green and another green. Yeah, the piano one's ridiculous. Like at that point, you're just playing piano. Maybe you are. What if like piano music was just like... Like one of those like Piano Freaks games or whatever. So instead of like sheet music, you just get a little screen there and the stuff would come down and you'd, you'd play it. I actually have no idea what he's talking about right now. This is I'm in a different zone right now. I'm playing this game. I'm trying to win my game. I'm playing my game and trying to win my game. Wait, did you buy that thing? What? The watch? No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> where, where did you look? Oh, I just saw like your purchase was complete. No, you're probably just seeing these cool stuff ones. When I was in Denver, I had to drive an hour from the airport to my hotel. It was raining really badly, and for a half of an hour, these guys were racing down the highway, showing down, slowing down so everyone would pass them, then speeding through traffic. Yeah. yeah, there's actually a lot of that here, I've noticed. Like, Katie says she has to deal with it all the time on the interstate on her way home. Like, I can hear it outside, like, because there's a highway right outside of this, like, right out this way. Discard two cards. Sure, land and ghostly changeling. Seems fine. And I'm just going to Karthus your face. Ah, Karthus, you mullet. Fucking <laughs> forest. Comical. So they go double block here, but that doesn't kill it, right? So I guess they can go block with this guy and these two, and then they both die. The problem is that, like, I guess they have to block, right? They have to block at this guy. Do they have any flying? They have to block both of these guys, right? Because they're going to one. So I guess they could chump here, chump... They could chump here, pump, and chump here. And then they have this four power guy. And I don't think that kills us. They can't block. They got to block with, like these two and I eat I, I still don't get to eat both yeah we'll just we'll just tag with Karthus here this guy doesn't this is super weird and like freaking me the fuck out Alexa stop I really need to look into that because it's kind of creeping me out now Is it like Mike B at work, like, fucking around? Like, I don't understand what's going on. Yeah. 
Hold on, I'm checking the Alexa app and be like, what just triggered you? Oh, we win. I like it. Boom. More. Is your, like, Alexa, like, locked to, like, only you, people on your network or something? Voice history. That's weird. So at two twenty at four twenty four, my original echo, which is the one that's in the living room, heard the command. What was the command? Just the name. Just Alexa and it started playing Don't music. Say the fucking name. I'm trying to avoid saying it. See, now it's going to pop up again. And then at 424, same minute, which was like two minutes ago, my Echo Plus, which is in the bedroom, which is the one I have, or my, my office, the one that's in here, it says audio was not intended for this device. So I think that means it heard its, mm -hmm. it got triggered, but it was just like, oh, it's not for me. Right. Weird. Right. And then 424, my Echo Dot, which is in the bedroom, it says audio was not intended for this device. And then at 424, it heard stop. There was no command given that would make it play. Spooky. Yeah, I can say bring in this, take out this. But I mean, like, I kind of like Arena. I just think it's really good. Do we have any life gain that we're not bringing in? Wait, why are we taking Arena out? Well, because they're kind of aggressive. They hmm. seem like they had a, a bunch of aggressive dudes. I kind of like Butcher's Glee. Do we have any of those... Uh... All the creatures get negative one, negative one? Yes, but they didn't have that many one ones. Okay. I took out the Seal of Doom because we already have Capsule and like, they don't have a ton of non-black creatures, it seems like. Yes, you're, this is Kerwit. <laughs> Cherwit Mike. Same thing. Yeah, seems fine. Two, three drops. Perhaps it's time for the listening device. I mean, like, not really. I mean, the convenience of being to turn my lights off or turn my lights on or, you know check the time or the weather or check where packages are like i mean that's significantly more convenient to me than uh you know amazon randomly listening to me and me assuming that they give a shit about any of the things they hear like it just doesn't make any like that 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 kind of criticism is always weird to me like amazon's listening like there's not gonna be there's so many there's so many devices and so many homes that like there's no fucking human there's no way a human being could parse through all of that information and listen to it like there's not one dude sitting around listening to like my amazon things that like like from this it just doesn't make any sense you know does it make sense like
Like the cost that 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 cost to me is minimal. Well, yeah. So like, if I say something like four times and they don't get it, like Shit, obviously they're gonna try to figure mind. out why. What happened? I left for like two hours. Two thirty-four fifty-six. Come on, guys. I don't know. I I can't. I can't explain these people. Do you think they're gonna have an indestructible? No, they didn't. Amazon blackmail. It's a new. It's a new uh, service. Yeah, like I don't have enough to offer that. I don't have enough to offer Jeff Bezos and Amazon for them to blackmail me. You know, like. <laughs> what did it find, uh, Tanos? <laughs> did you mean duck porn? No, no. <laughs> I've uh, had a couple times where I like we sacrifice to discard three cards. Yeah, we're definitely instilling an infection on this guy before they do anything shenanigans. I had like one time where I like, hey, turn off the lights. And instead of doing that, it like called some guy from work. <laughs> Calling Richard Brights. And you're no, like, stop. Oh, oh. That's not what I mean. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have one, two, three, four, five. We got a duck charge. <laughs> oh my god. You're so loud. You're so loud. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Oh, 316 Stone Cold Steve Austin. <laughs> wow, that's a meme, all right. Tonos, that's probably for the better. One, two, three, five, six. So they're, so they're very far from, like, having their own guy. I guess we'll just play this idiot, right? Seems good. I mean, I'll trade these two, and then I'll play my own duck charger. God, I appreciate you guys with your... I, I love these random, like, donation trains that you guys get on. Because it's like, it's only two or three bucks. But the memes are funny. And it does end up supporting me. So it's like, it's perfect. Everybody wins. <clears throat> oh, I gotta, I gotta have this one too. Uh, newly listed and not Lois. There we go. They could have Echoing Truth, which is like neg two, neg two. In which case, that's fine. Oh, they definitely do. <laughs> so we're going to prevent three here. Because it dies to either one of these anyway. But if you want to like... They have two cards. If one of them is like neg two, neg two, that's fine. I'll deal with it. Oh, look. They had it. They have one card. We have five. That seems fine. Land. Nice. Got him. You don't want to megamorph it? I don't. I don't really feel like spending 10 mana. I'd rather just spend the 6. But then he'd be 5, 6, 7. Oh, God, you're right. God, you're right. I'm trying to care. I really... I'm close. I feel your pain. <laughs> well, not everybody wins. Rip Blink 180. That's true. Alright, well... So, four, five, six, seven, eight. They're two perms away from making this guy a big daddy. Um, I'm probably just going to Chandra's Evolution it. Tap down a red. Music Manly, that sounds awkward. Awkward! Did you say awkward? Yes. Nice. If we hit a land, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... We can play Dusk Charger, Filigree Familiar, and get the Sitting's Blessing, so it's a 5-5. Five, five. That's kind of cool. Is he licking that blanket? He's licking his foot. He's doing oh, a little foot. His, foot. his foot looks suspiciously like the blanket, though. In my defense. <laughs> Buddy, you don't have to defend yourself here. You're among friends. This is, this is wild. Oh, man. Are you reading these? Mm hmm Okay. I'll probably put... Oh, that's perfect. That's what we wanted. One, two, three. Filigree Familiarios. And this guy just comes into play as a 5-5 five, five because of the city's blessing. If we played it the other way, they have a chance to respond to this guy if like, they have a lightning bolt or something. But right now, this guy just enters as a 5-5 five, five, and that's pretty cool you could have uh, you could have played Nanamorphos to draw an extra card too 
I actually could have because we don't need the green. But we also... Oh, they just conceded. Our deck is very good. Yes. We're 4-0. Blam. Shut up and take my money. Okay. 341. Well, there's obviously no winning, so I guess I'll just lean in. Yeah, 246.57 is exactly where you should be, I think. Oh, boy. David Blaine. <laughs> okay. Is this one image? No, they're all different images. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> my brother shot a movie with uh, Danny Trejo in it. Wow. Two presidential top eight finishes. Robert Downey Jr. Shut up and take my money. Pitter patter. Let's get at her. <laughs> it's not even. It doesn't even make any fucking sense. Shut up and take my oh, money. Oh boy, Tano's Ford Twenty BRB for reasons. Oh, you see. Once I know, like, once I know it's a Seattle guy, I'm like, oh, I get it. If it was a Denver guy, I'd also, I'd also be like, oh, I get it. I get it. You know, join that match. Do you guys ever do this face? To like stretch out your eyes and stuff? You guys ever do that? You ever do that face? Get them eyeball stretches. Do you? Get them limber eyeballs. I fucking know you do. Don't even try to make it like you don't do it. Don't you guys try to be like, oh, I don't make that face. You do. Everyone does them limber eyeballs <laughs> buddy don't talk about my limber eyeballs okay hey my limber eyeballs are up here okay <laughs> so limber the, the most limber <laughs> I've never made that face I was born without a face eyes without a face that is the girls putting on mascara face That's very true. Dang. Nailed it. Just nailed it. Look at my sweet ghostly changeling. He's everything to everyone. <laughs> you gotta keep them balls limber. Eyeballs, that is. I was never given a name. Who is this? spicy that was spicy i felt good about when it happened if they get to if they if we if we trade and they kill this then we just get to play angler next turn. you tell them to get angled buddy i'm gonna sound and be like get angled <laughs> <laughs> oh man that's gonna be wild i don't think emperor nick's gonna like that oh shit that is emperor nick Patrick Bateman. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to send this in the chat because it's freaking hilarious. Oh, man. This is good stuff. Shut up and take my money. Oh, Dad Jokes donated 789. Thanks, Dad Jokes. God, Dad Jokes never lets you down. Are you okay? Are you, are you exploding? No, I'm good. Probably. You're probably good. Yeah. You know, we're going to put a counter on this guy. And then whenever this guy outlasts. And you kill him we too. We just kill him too. So. Get wrecked. No, we didn't tell OP to get angled. No, we didn't. We didn't enter it. I didn't put it in the chat. Because I don't want them to. I don't want to offend anybody with their. We don't want anyone to actually get angled. I'm just going to take four here because I can just kill it next turn. Seems good. And they know that, which is why they're getting in there. Mm -hmm. Emperor Nick is like, shoot. Plus it also has first strike, so I can't really trade. Oh, but if they kill this, can you imagine? Then we just gave them this for nothing. God, that's going to feel so bad. You'd have to shame scoop. Oh, he got a counter. 
What? You done screwed up. Oh, that's wild. Oh, this is... This is a turn. Dude, blow it all up. <laughs> Can I untap this guy? Look at our hand. It's literally just mono removal and a Gurmag Angler. What if they made, like, a reverse delve where you could exile cards from the opponent's graveyard? What if? Can you imagine? What a time to be alive that would be. What a time to be alive. <laughs> Eyes without a face. Wait, did you kill it? No, not yet. Where did you? I can, I can block it. Where did you spend the money, the man on? What are you saying right now? I don't, I don't know. You don't know, do you? Eyes without a face. Do, 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 do. I'm loving it. Let's block here. Get that value. If they want to pump it, that's fine. I'll just shoot it. Uh, Celestial Flare. Kill this guy. <laughs> ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. I guess we're going to have to sack this guy. They got us. I feel so seen. But I don't want to take three more, so. Good call. Thank you. Get out of my baby. Get into my car. So what do we got? Gurmag Angler is going to cost three. Let's get four, three. Can't pump you. Get into my car. Shut up and take my money. Oh, okay. Cheshire Cat, I was the original Eyes Without a Face. Wow, that's true. not wrong. That's not wrong. Can we get any of these things back? I don't think so. So I'm gonna Gurmy. Oh, Gurmy. Remember that from Muppet Babies? Yes. That's cool. Miss Piggy was really into that Gurmag Angler. Weren't we all, though, you know? What I mean with that, that lure on the front of its face, how could you not be? Aren't anglerfish, you ever seen anglerfish before? No. Are you serious? Yeah, I know what they look like. Okay, I was like, because they're terrifying, dude. But I've never actually seen one in real life. Oh, yeah, well, that's because they live in the deep, deep. S some people go down there. Who? Who do you think? Uh, Who's going down there? You're going to pacify this Maybe guy? Jacques Cousteau. Is that right? <laughs> this pacifism makes me real sad. Yeah. More like a sadifism, you know what I mean? Do we have uh No we don't. I don't think we have anything. We're out of cards now. James Cameron maybe actually, that's a good point. That's a good point. I believe it's James Cameron. Depends on if they're in the Marianas trench. James? Maybe. You know, maybe. Maybe you're onto something here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm just gonna play this because I can pump now. I feel like despite all our removal, they're still they're still coming through for us here. I don't, I don't like it. They're they're coming for us here. Mm. How many times can you pump that uh, changeling? As many times as I want. Oh yeah. You don't know. You don't know me. You don't know my life. You're you're right. I don't. I know. The James Cam unring onion rings. I don't know what's happening right now. Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. That's what I was hoping to draw. Um, so I'm just going to pass again because... Oh, can you... Let's get Karthus, Tyrant of Jun, then we can steal their Dragon Will. Mm. Mm. Oh, I see. Well. Man, I felt like we were doing good here. Is this game two? It's something, all right. This is game one. Oh, I said, hey, hey. Um.
One, two, three, four, five, six. Sure. Maximize that damage. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, okay, that's plenty. Mm. Give me that blessing. Mm. 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 Give it to me. Give it to me. Were there any cards that like did stuff if you had the city's blessing but didn't have a send? No. Because that's too like disconnected from from like the the mechanics and stuff, you know. Yeah. There's a 6 now? Ugh. How? Oh. Okay, you got it. Cool story, bro. That wasn't going to do it. Marshall, Marshall, Marshall. Cosmotronic Wave actually seems pretty bananas against them. They had a bunch of X1s. That'll teach them. You know, I hope it does. I hope it teaches them something. I hope they learn. Electronic. Cosmotronic. Shut up and take my money. What? The Deep Deep, we here at the Deep Deep assure you that there are no Gurmag anglers or Titanic directors here at our spacious resort. Wow, you guys have your own resort? Yeah, it's very, very plush. That seems nice. Deep Deep, thank you so much for informing us. You're really, uh, you're doing the Lord's work. Any new comic stuff? No. I'm looking at this dog meat statue, though. What is that? Oh, Fallout 70s. Or Fallout, Fallout 4. 4, yeah. Man, the Deep Deep was just so generous. It's very nice when the... Oh, this, look at this. This is the perfect hand. Mm. 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 This guy's like a three for one. It gains two. It blocks and, and eats their guy, and then we draw a card? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What was that Cinnamon Toast Crunch? Oh, it actually is CTC. Wow, that's hilarious. He's basically Euro. Yeah. I wish we could get him back from the graveyard, though. That'd be sweet. Someone keeps outbidding me on this. Tell them to stop. I will. I'll go over to their house. Hey. And punch hey. them in the face. You knock on their door. Stop hitting me! What's the high bid? 32.45? Fine. Fine. You happy now? 32.50. Fine. I, you know what? Just do, what, do it. Whatever. I don't care. Your bid is live. Am I the high bidder now? Yeah, that's right. Mm. Mm. That's a good hand, man. They didn't do anything? Shoot. Get out of my dream. Oh, God. Oh, you won't believe what a good boy he is. Is that from something? No, he's just a good boy. He's Canadian. Oh, Jesus. Shut up and take my money. Okay. The shallow, shallow. We will not be outdone. Well, you're going to need to do more than that. God, this is the second Brazen Wolves we played against. No, don't like that. Oh, we can Oh, look at this. I'll reveal Karen Wander. Oh, I guess I could have revealed Changeling, too. Tricked him. I don't think I tricked... I don't think so. I think I just gave them more information. Tricky. <laughs> that's not... I've never bought anything on eBay. Wow, that's crazy. Imagine what they'll think you have in your hand if that's what you revealed. Do you buy... 
I think they would think that that's the only elf in my hand. <laughs> how how frequently are you on eBay? Do you, you buy stuff on eBay? Uh, I don't. Not so much anymore. <laughs> A chimera of Garfield, Richard Garfield, and Seth Manfield. Horrifying nightmare. Never look into its eyes. <laughs> Seth Garfield. Oh, dear Jesus. Uh, I'll just take the four here, because... Because I'm not an idiot. <laughs> what did you say about eBay? What was your answer? Uh, I don't use it so much anymore. Oh, it's not... It's not... You're not... It's not your thing anymore? No. Oh, you know, back in my day... This guy just have first strike? Oh, because they're paired? Sure. You know what? Sure. Fine. Whatever. I don't even care. Like, I, I don't even care. When you kill him, Karen Wanderer will have first strike. You? <laughs> See, that's funny. Oh, Lord. This is a quality post, man. Oh, good. They did a thing to my guy again. I love it. Oh, and they and they bushwhacked. Well, I'll definitely block the fiver. And draw an eye blighter. Eye blight or hunter of the eye blight would be better if it had haste. Eight. One, two, three, four. <laughs> yeah, or if it put a negative one, negative one counter on a creature instead. Yeah, that'd be good too. Yeah. You ain't kidding. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we can't we can't get the city's blessing today. But in the future. Um, I think we're just passing here, and then we'll just dark withering if they attack with the brazen wolves. If not, we can block whatever else they play. Shut yeah, that sounds good. My money. That seems fine. The Shallow Shallow has been told time and time again that they are to cease using that name after our lengthy lawsuit. Please ignore these clear ripoff artists. Not to mention the sh Damn it. It was so long. And I gotta go to... I gotta go to the old Streamlabs itself. Not to mention Shallow Waters for Turd Burglars. The Deep Deep. Just... Just fantastic. Watch out for them turd burglars. Buddy, I have to watch out every day. You understand? Mm-hmm. You understand? Oh, I understand. Okay. Get wrecked. And they're going to shoot us for one, so. They're going to try to. They'll succeed. Okay. <laughs> Karen Wander after being pacified. Probably. Let me speak to your manager. <laughs> See, that's funny. But you're funny. This is Karen Wander. You draw a nice little uh, bob haircut on her. Katie's leaving work now. Sweet. I eat turd burgers for you like breakfast. Wait, that's not what you said. You eat turd burgers for breakfast? No. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, we're so good at this game. Give me that sit give me that blessing. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is what it feels like to get in there with your big daddy daddy horse. Shitter McGavin. <laughs> God damn. Mike B gets off at six. Mike B gets off at six. Yeah. Okay. Do we decide what Italian restaurant we're going to? No, because no one said anything. Let's go to the you one as much as I do. That's not the Olympic one or whatever. Okay, you're. I feel like you're real biased because of that. Yeah. I am. Well. I'm not going to a place with bad photography. I got news for you, buddy. You you are. 
You are. Well, I guess that's true. Got him. Got him. Get out of my dreams. Get out of my dreams. Get into my car. You know who this song is? You know who sings this song? Yeah. Mm, right said Fred. Yeah, it's actually Right said Fred. And he was then he was like, I'm too sexy for my car. And then he got a new car. Then you were like, Wow, look at him go with those cars. In cars, Baroner. You know what? I think we're holding back here. Prudent. Yeah, that's true, Thomas. Take my money. Oh, the shallow shell. The deep deep can suck my hose. Go to hell, deep deep, and you can send all correspondence to my attorney. <laughs> Oh, dear Jesus. Wow, this is... This is quite the rivalry. I, uh... I don't know what to make of any of this. You guys are really having a moment here. Well, I have two cards, so there's no way they can win here, right? No. Yeah, I didn't think so. You can't win with two cards. You can win with one card, but not two. Two cards is just greedy. Yeah. Like, just enjoy the cards you have and stop making a thing about it, you know? Oh, we're going. We're getting red. Yeah, I'm not going to take two just because you got this stupid idiot, so I'll just block it. I think it's just a suicide because he knows he's going to die next turn. It's... Not a suicide. It's not a suicide. They never don't have the exact thing they need. Hey, look, it's Celestial Flare. <laughs> sure is. Sure, sure. Surely is. Ooh. It does nothing. Ooh. <laughs> nope, not even ooh. Yep, that's pretty bad. See, and also because of the first strike, it's really bad. Because now they get to, we get to block here. And when we shoot this thing... Yeah, this is actually terrible. Oh, wow, they're just attacking with that guy. Oh, wow, that's terrible. This is definitely an alpha situation. I block here, and then I shoot this thing. And then you sack it to dig a deal onto this, and then my guy dies. Like, that's... still feel like we kind of have to block, though, because of goblin bombardment yeah like we go to five and then they already have three creatures on the board so Thank you. yeah i think we're just two one in this again i think we have yet to trophy this format unfortunately so i guess we just take one here yep strider thank you for the resub buddy tireless tractor i don't know if i said it but thank you for the resub as well and lightning. So we take five, they sack both guys, and that is the end. All right. Well, we tried. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at mandatraders.com. You get 15% off now the first three months of any subscription. And uh, check out nordvpn.org slash if you're looking for a sweet internet security solution. And I'll see you guys next time.